Welcome to the Jungle Travelers. G'day guys, I'm Ryan. And I'm Luke, how you going? And we are the Chunky Travelers. <laughs> <laughs> ah, day two. Yeah, day two of the Four Drive Show. It is a little wet. Unpleasant. But hopefully, hopefully it will... Uh, Somehow I feel like it's going to clear up for a little while and then yeah. it's going to get real wet again. Yeah, so... Yeah, we're just about to jump in the lifts. We just parked up. It's right next to the RNA showgrounds. That bloke's in his jocks up there. Where? He's up there, yeah. Hey, mate. Oh, he is too. If you're watching, you're how are you? Cheeky little nut huggers. Well done, mate. Well done. That's a that's a good bod. That's the way to live your life. <laughs> oh, it's given it. Anyway. Well, yeah, we're um, <clears throat> hanging your shit down there, and yeah, hopefully that leaves up a bit. But yeah, that's right. There's plenty to do inside, so yeah. we're keen to hook in. Yeah. But uh, yeah, we'll take his with us. He was upset all night about it. He's like, I don't think he's real happy with me. I didn't even hear it. I mean, you can't really talk, to be honest. I know, I know. It was like, you know how they call big people tiny? Yeah. It was like that. Yeah, it's all right, mate. I didn't even hear it. I'd appreciate it if you could call me tall. You are tall. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. Nice. Awesome, Jam. Have a go, man. And we'll swing around behind the gladiator. Notice how it was instant gay talk as soon as we got in a Jeep. Mm. <laughs> Alright, time to do some wrangling. <laughs> Men wrangling. Do we, do we have to wave every time we pass the gladiator? It's like Jeep wave? <laughs> yeah. It's only, it's only polite. Yeah. Jeep rules apply. Right? Yeah, cool. No, I'm down for that, mate. Yeah, it is better. That, that camera's good, eh? Yeah. It's just so much better to look at the dash yeah. on this, eh? I like the Gladiator, like the room yeah. that's got your, your red. Yep. Yeah, it's sick. And a few more switches. Have they got like heaps of hidden Jeep things around? Still? Yeah, good. Corner of the windscreen. Oh, yeah, nice, yep. Do we have to hold hands at this point? <laughs> well, I'll, um... Yeah, it is. Straight away, it's onto that. It's just slow too. Are you on the brake or? Wow. So slow. It's a couple of other Easter eggs for you. On the wheel, you've got three points. Yep. They're the same positioning of the original Willys Jeep spokes on the steering wheel. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, sick. That's a cool one. I like that. I only found that one out the other day. Wow. What a day to be out in a Jeep with no roof when it's raining. <laughs> so, a couple of weeks back, I just finished building the Gladiator and um, DJ well, took the club out to Land Cruiser. Yep. So, 6 in the morning, it's pouring rain. He messages me at 5 a.m. To, to be like, uh, have you seen the weather? And he drove it out to Cruiser like that. Oh, true. No doors, no roof. Yeah, sick. Yeah. I like his style. 
That's what you do as a Jeep lover. You gotta, you gotta be passionate about it. Yeah, exactly. Just slow down for a little bit. Just slowly. I just want to show it speed first. So what I'm going to do is, if I do it slowly, you'll actually see the technology. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And the turning circle is actually really good. Yeah. Mm. So like, mine's more practical than the gladiator. Yeah, it is, yeah. And then it will start wrecking off. So as we accelerate a little bit more, it will actually break that wheel and send power. See, I'm a lag, you know. Like, I'll take your shit out of stuff. And then I'll let you have power. Yeah, yeah. With a hard top or soft top, one of these, the bounce up, you can load it back to the real one. Yeah. Not off the ground. <laughs> can we go back here? We'll go back on the one. So we're going to reverse it. Yeah, you got no luck with it. Being a sustained car, it probably um, demonstrates it a little bit better than the others because the world got left here, some big wheels and all this stuff. And here's the ring we're doing it, ready? Right? So, what's this little goal? Probably just got a little bit fast, but. Yeah, Conrad, speed. up on top. See, the Wrangler's good because you can actually look at your wheel when you go up there. You can actually oh, yeah. glance the wheel. Get side to it. Look at him, he's in his element. He's just loving it. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you're a Jeep salesman. No. Huh? Oh, true, yep. Yeah. Oh, that's still pretty good, eh? Got a Iron Man, nothing that. better. Work club. Yeah, dude, dude. Yeah. 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 That's all. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, yeah. A little bit high. Good angle. Is there something else about four driving with no roof on? Well, I'll admit. Probably my favourite bit about it. Yeah. Oh, I'll do that. Remember my yeah, friend cool. Park, Sebastian. Yeah. yeah. On Double O and running through all the fresh water that comes out, just water coming yeah. over the top. Yeah. <laughs> he loves it. Yeah. He's a hairdresser as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Look at that HD camera on it. Oh, yeah. So good, eh? And then when you get into like your Rubicons or the Gladiator, it's the larger screen in it. Yeah. yeah. And it's just phenomenal. So you get your front trail cam. Not my deck, but it's still good quality. Mm. Yeah, that's awesome. Here, mate. All right. So, you got your build plate. Lovely. So Looks all good. the weighting depths and measurements and everything. Yep. In the headlight. Yeah. The oh yeah. You can see the the grill and the headlight. That's that's awesome. I don't know my favourite bit about it. Awesome. Thank you very much. That's all right, guys. Happy. Yeah, mate. We can't. We can't stay away. <laughs> yeah. Every time we see it, we're just like, oh my god. Yeah, frothing. <laughs> are you guys YouTube stars? Or what? Yeah, we are. We wouldn't yeah. say stars. Yeah, like but... almost 200 subscribers. <laughs> 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 Let's do it. Hopefully, with you guys in our videos. You guys look so familiar. Like... Obviously, when I first saw you the other day, yeah, yeah. I just seen you YouTube. Oh, it's true. It's pretty catchy. I'm not yeah. gonna lie. Just with um, <laughs> rubbish tritons and getting bogged all the time. Does that ring a bell? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure. You just look familiar. Yeah, yeah.
Nah, cool. we're hoping off of you guys we'll get famous because you're in our video, so. <laughs> <laughs> so can we just get a quick subscribe and like for some travelers? Shout out. <laughs> <laughs> Done. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to better right. than them. Two, <laughs> two, 250 more than we got. <laughs> No, that's right. We thought we were going to sneak a sticker, one of our stickers on your car somewhere, but we thought it was better. Stick it over there? Oh, yeah. That's George. Yeah. Oh, that's a go. Love it. That man, that'd be awesome. But I was just saying to this guy last night, I was like, we gotta go back because I've seen all your stickers on the other side. I was like, we need to get a sticker on there somewhere. Because every time he opens that lid on the show, I'm like, our stickers in there. <laughs> yeah, you oh, oh. oh sorry, yeah. Sorry. I thought <laughs> Oh he's gonna put it on everything. Hey. Love it. I wouldn't be able to reach. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. Nice. Highlight. Look at that. Dude, you're a champion. <laughs> Love it. Get it up in there. Look at this, eh? There you go. <laughs> Supporting the little guys. <laughs> oh, that's oh, awesome. I've got a question. Yeah. Where's your most favourite spot to go in the Queensland? We'll go to Queensland because COVID, you know, they're a bit That's the answer we were hoping for. <laughs> yeah, we're yeah. going to do a camp trip in June. We've never been up there, so... The Bill, Bill yeah. uh, we went up on a bit dry last. Uh, oh, yeah, it it the is quite good. It can be quite good. Yeah. But, um, look, the telly track, I can spend a week on the telly track just out there. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's our going to be our highlight, what we're looking forward to the most, yeah. is the telly. Uh, yeah, I think... Um, yeah, there's, not, there's a few things I want to do. I want to have a beer at the tip, I want to have a fish at the tip and do gun shots. Uh, there's, some, there's some goals my wife won't let me do, but... Yeah. <laughs> you know, all that no worries at all. She's like, you're not going anywhere near gun shots. Make sure you go to the Yeah, yeah. Sure. Yeah, we're in the whole day playing there. Because oh, yeah. we've got... Yeah. Uh, how many kids will there be? There'll be four... Seven? Four under ten, and then a couple others. So. A couple other ones, yeah. Um, so we yeah, we want to make fun of the kids, get them in the swimming yeah. pools. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, we're okay, keen, mate. We'll be good. I hear the four drive 24-7 boys are going up at the same time. Oh, End right. of May, yeah. Yeah, we're across the bars with Yeah, yeah, what's up? Is it ba Bailey? Yeah, yeah, Maverick, yeah, yeah. Maverick, yeah, yeah. We were talking to him yesterday, he was telling giving us the inside scoop. Yeah. He's a nice <laughs> so, dude, eh? He what a champion. Talking to us for, yeah, yeah. 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 Just camping wasn't quite his cup of tea with all the boys when we went up there. Yeah. He was it's a bit homesick, I think. Yeah, yeah okay. Well, he's, he'd have to come a long way though, like, you know. We did. Yeah. Travel up there and a few dramas with his car and whatever else. And yeah. A little bit stressful. Yeah. yeah. And when you're that young, yeah. you throwing in the deep end, I think he did really well. He can draw it. Oh, yeah. That was the awesome sound at camp trail. Get air on gunshot. Was yeah. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No. Top. Top job he does. Yeah. Very very good. Yeah. Thanks, mate. Bye, mate. We appreciate the time. Thank you very much. Oh, good, yeah. <laughs> big, 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 big. Yeah. Sure. How are you? Very very. Well. What? Familiar? Yeah, we're here on Friday. Well, I was asking about moustache tips. Moustache tips, yeah. <laughs> Didn't work by the looks. <laughs> <laughs> um, I've got some questions to ask. Oh, Alright. 
We're from Bastard, so we go out to Rocky, yeah. we go fishing Rocky. Barra. Mm. Amazing. Probably not the best Barra person to ask. I've done very limited amounts, but it depends on the style of fishing you do. You want to dig rock bars or in the snags or probably just off the off the bank I reckon. I could get it get me boat in there but or is it just like a narrow little creek? Yeah, just underneath. You know, I'm not going to tell you where it is. But... <laughs> I just put it on a pin on a map. And... No, 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 for other people. Oh, yeah. I'll tell you later. After no, don't tell me. <laughs> okay, don't ready to go. Me. Um, mate, I'd probably be using, if, if you could cast over the other side and you can get into the other snags, I'd be using those weedless cherubin and, and uh, Hovex and Zeric ones, just because you can belt them into the snags and then just twitch them out. Like, if you get a minnow, you, you chuck it on the right, boost, uh, Base of them, and then you're walking them out from there, but the barrel's in here, so you get the odd one that comes out and crunches it. If you smack it back in there, it's right in their base, and all you have to do is go, yeah. and eat it. Yeah. That's why he is the best. You're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> made it up on the spot, hopefully it works. <laughs> nah, that, that's what I do, and it's weedless too, so you, most of the time, like, you do still pull them into snags and they get stuck, but like, nine out of ten times they come back out, so just go nice and easy. And, like, then you don't have to do anything too, those prawns, it's all on the drop, you chuck it in there, let them slowly sing and just go, and that's all you have to do. So there's no like whack 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 and all this fancy stuff, it's just they glide down all the next step and you know, embarrass them. Yeah, nice. But that's what I do. Yeah. Sick, yeah. Oh, well, we never caught a barrett, so <laughs> we're obviously doing it wrong too. The other way it'd just be liveys, man. Liveys, log barra, they love them. Especially if you, if you can do like a dawn or dusk like into the night, that's when they start to come out of the snags and do a bit of patrolling. They're not so structure orientated, they've got to move up and down. So if you, you fish the arvo with lures and don't do too well, so you can get a couple of mullet and just stay for an hour after dark. Yeah. That's where you can find a, you just put your livey in a bit of a hole rather than in the snags and you just pick them up as they cruise through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah right there's on. definitely bar in there. Like, oh, yeah, man, yeah. Yep. It's got to crack that code. Like, <coughs> some, some estuaries are really clicky where they'll, they'll only eat one style of presentation and because yeah. they're like completely zoned in on that they might be just eating potties and stuff in there instead of prawns with ADR. Yeah, yeah. If you can get liveys that's going to be your short fly but if you want to chase lures I'd be pegging weedless yeah. things right up there. You can rig um, like uh, like a paddle tail weedless as well yep. but I don't know you seem to have to work them pretty quick so you're pulling them out of the snag really fast rather than letting them stay in there. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. The longer you can leave it in there the better. Yeah, cool. And I've got some really good tips on how to throw a cast net too, so I can get live as good. Excellent, excellent. <laughs> what up? Uh, up over the shoulder. Yeah. Yep. So with a, but you don't have to use that method for like a bait net. That's just for your big prawning nets. Because there's so much net and so much lead line there, you actually need the ramps to, to spread it right over. I mean, if you've just got a 10 foot like bottom pocket, you should just be able to close one and just go around and get a few revolutions there and it'll go if you go off the shoulder, you're dropping it at your feet and forward. The other one you can project more, so you can 10 to 5 metres that way and the land you know, there and forward. Which for mullet, like those things, it's just so you go like this and they go boom. Yeah. So I'd, I'd stick with that way. Just get a smaller net and launch it as far as you can. So, um, first one just out the radio, get up there and here? I don't think so. I don't think so. But you get like a BCF have them, the back world has them, all those places have them. Yeah, I think they're like 10 bucks a pop, but like I've done full, full days jack sessions and not lost one. Yeah. Do you know if you in this creek, can you like get to the other side and just snag up and you go and get it? Or, nah. or would it be a swim? No, I probably yeah. wouldn't go in that river. Lizards. Oh, it's right. Crocky. Yeah. Very crocky, yeah. yeah. You will you grab a couple then. Yeah. yeah. Like Savage Gear do one as well, so you can wait for them to go on sale and you get them for like two bucks or three mm. bucks each. Yeah, yeah right, eh? They're yeah, essentially the same thing. Yeah. But, um, yeah. yeah, right, so eh? As cheap as you can get out of it, because if you can't go get them, then you will lose a couple because yeah. they don't hung up. Yeah. Usually in a boat, you just get your little D hook and things, you bang and pop them off. Yeah. But um, if you can't go over there, what? Yeah. Because under good ad like yeah, good advice, we've been told there's big barra in this certain spot we're going to try, so yeah. we're hoping off the bank will do it but um well the thing with Gladstone is you're always running that chance that one of those barra is one of the ones that came out of the Wonga three or four years ago and it's oh. going to be a metre twenty yeah like oh. those things are gone on and, and it's not uncommon to man there's guys on the Gladstone fishing 
Facebook page, pulling big barry and all yeah. the and thread fins like massive. Yeah, and it's super close to the Mary, which is one of the biggest breeding populations of barra in southeast Queensland. Yeah. And they've got some special genus of fish there that just get like you rarely hear of someone going to the Mary River and going, Oh I've got a fifty five today. It's like, yeah. hey, I've got a meter twenty yeah. again. <laughs> yeah. It's like that big fish, so yeah. yeah. There's a yeah, fair chance you'll get one of those prawns right up there and some sea moss is going to eat it. You're going to get yeah. a towel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But That's all we're hoping. Well, even that'd be good. I'd be happy with that. Yeah. Big croc grabbing on it or something. A bit exciting. Like yeah, no. Crocs. <laughs> Mate, yeah. <laughs> oh, they they only recently moved a six metre croc from there, good. like in the last few months. Yeah. Good. Just a little one. Yeah, yeah. He wouldn't eat much. <laughs> Just twist a leg off or something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Six meters. Yeah. Okay. yeah it was something. Oh man, it was ridiculous. This thing. Careful, lads. Yeah. They're cruising around. Oh, be careful. I'll probably. Yeah. We might go on the boat. Yeah. Why not? We can do a bit. We'll bring the boat. First, suss it out. Yeah. Because if you can get there and you can't, there's nowhere to stand. Like there's mangroves, thick mangroves on both sides. Hey, yeah, what are you going to do? If you're standing like this. Like sometimes yeah. you can't get to the water's edge because it's just yeah. mangroves are so thick. You end yeah, up yeah. fishing. Tree. Yeah. Take your boat first, suss it out, pick your spots and where you can stand and all yeah. that stuff. We're not real ready. fast on our feet either, so get through mangroves running from a crocs probably not the <laughs> ideal. <laughs> I, I saw those, you could probably just be like, just, just, just yeah. the shoulder and have a crocs. I've been running quick. Yeah. 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 As you're coming down now, yeah. aren't you? You guys got perfect timing. Yeah, flipping out. Yeah. Oh, awesome. Oh, That's awesome. Good. Thank you very much. No problem, glad. Appreciate it, mate. Shoot a, um, shoot a picture through me, buddy. Facebook, don't say anything on Instagram, it gets lost. Yeah, okay. Yeah, deal. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, Nearest. I, every now and then I'll see you on the, oh, what's it, the South East Queensland Fishing, what's it, it is, or the... Yeah, SEQ Fishing and Brawling. <coughs> yeah, that's it. A little bit of posting up there. Yeah, sick, yeah. Throw up our way, Trunk of Travellers. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah, GoPro. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you were going to that, that's what I pointed before I said, oh, oh right. I'm not telling people our spots. Oh, um, I thought you were just pointing at him. <laughs> I'm lucky, I'm lucky. Yeah, yeah we're not. Oh, you were alright with that though? Yeah, that's all good. Sorry, man. Sweet. I didn't swear or anything at all. That's alright. Yeah. <laughs> that's alright. Yeah. It's all good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I will, will. Yeah, that's cool. It'll, it'll be a really massive beep so everyone knows. <laughs> <laughs> it goes for like a 15 second. <laughs> yeah. And we just, just pause the... the video as well so we can make it. Long yeah. Long. yeah. <laughs> uh, awesome, man. Thank you very much. Thanks, mate. Good we'll talk to you. Uh, don't know if we did. G'day, guys. Well, that's the end of this day because the, uh, the weather The weather just as took you a turn the worst. So. We're going to yeah, pull the switch. Yeah, we saw a lot of things on the Friday anyway, so today's a Sunday, so we're getting out of here. And yeah. Had Conrad with us too. Yeah. Thanks, Conrad. <laughs> Champion. Just our sort of cameraman, sort of slash GoPro holder, <laughs> accessories. <laughs> it's like having a canopy on your, on your, on the back of your car, and you just store your stuff in there. <laughs> Well, yeah, that's where we'll end it off. Um, yeah. Yeah, so I've got a few interviews in today, just different people, and it was good. Yeah, and I still can't get over the fact our stickers on DMW's 200 series. Oh, just, I'm still mind blown. I have not let that go all day. That's so good. And I can't remember, I can't believe he remembered us when yeah. we come in and he's just like, oh, the boys are back. So. Yeah, that was real, yeah, loved it. Yeah. But anyway, we'll um, see you on the next one. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Yep. Hit that bell as well. Yep, Why and stay not? chunky. Thanks for watching!